Hello YouTube and welcome to another video tutorial from Tutsub. This time I will show you how to create this audio visualization on Adobe After Effect. So, let me begin by opening After Effect and creating a new composition with the name, Audio Visualizer, my resolution will be 1920 by 1080 and the duration will be 1 minute, in your case you can put the duration of the audio file that you will use. Now go ahead and click OK. Next I will drag and drop the background image, and the audio that I will use into the project. After that drag and drop them into the composition. Now select the image and press S to reveal the scale option, and scale it to fit the size of the scene. Now go ahead and search for the hue and saturation effect in the effect and presets here, and then drag it to the image layer. And I will make this modification to make the image a little bit darker. Now lock the image layer so you don't accidentally move it later. Now to make the circle shape in the center, I will first add a new solid layer. And I will change its name to, Circle. Now draw a circle in the center of the solid layer using the ellipse tool. You can begin from the center and press at the same time Ctrl plus Shift to make a perfect circle. And as you can see a mask has been added to the solid here. Now from the effect and presets search for the audio spectrum effect and apply it to the solid layer like this. Now to get the same result as mine, change the end frequency here to 150 and the frequency band to 2000, also change the maximum height to 360 and the audio duration to 100, the thickness to 5 and the softness to 0%. After that change the inside and the outside colors to white. Don't forget to choose the audio layer here. And as you can see the spectrum is working. Now change the path to mask 1 to take the circle shape. And for the sides here, we only need the side B. Now to reveal the masked part here. Press M on the circle layer to go to the mask. And change this to none. Look like everything is working fine. Now to fix this issue here, I will add a mirror effect to the solid layer here. And I will change this value to 960. And as you can see the spectrum look better now. Next to add the coloration to the spectrum, I will simply duplicate it 3 times for every color. And for every layer I will change the colors here. And also I will add a little bit to the value of the maximum height, so it will appear behind the top layer like that. Now go ahead and repeat the same steps with the other layers.
Ok now to make the vertical spectrums I will duplicate the white circle layer here. And I will rename it, line. And I will change its path here to none. After that I will place its sends to the edges of the scene. Don't forget also to remove the mirror effect here. Now duplicate it again and move the new layer to the other side of the scene. Make sure that the audio spectrum effect is selected to be able to move it around like this. And as you can see we are nearly there. Now I will add a new solid layer with the name, Dust, to make the dust particles in the background. Move it under the other layers and search for the CC particle world effect to apply it to the layer. After that go ahead and deselect the horizon, axis box and grid here to clean up the view. Move the timeline indicator forward here so we can see this particle fountain. After that spread the particles across the scene, by increasing the radius X, Y and Z here. Change the animation to jet sideways. Give the velocity a 0.9 value and the gravity 0.09. The resistance 1.9 And the particle type will be faded sphere The birth and death size will be 0.03 and 0.07 in my case Now change the two colors here to white And the last thing I will do here is decreasing the longevity and the birth rate here. And after you made these changes you should get the same result as mine here. Now after finishing the hard part, I will quickly finish the design here by first adding this EPS file of two palms trees. Press S here to bring the scale option, and scale it down to something like 6%, and quickly move it to the top of the circle. Now finish the project by adding your texture logo in the center of the circle like this. Thank you guys I hope you have a lot of fun making this cool animation. And once again this is Ajlili with Tuts Up and I've got more tutorials coming up soon as always, please make sure to subscribe and like this video if you enjoy it. You can also click the thumbnail and watch another design creation video from this channel. See you next time guys.